What is going on guys welcome back to another video of notes application development in Android studio using firebase in last video we connected our app to the firebase and in create account page we added the validation for email password and confirm password we successfully created the account in firebase authentication in this video we will design the login screen and add functionality for login using firebase authentication so let's get started so let's go and create a new activity for login activity go to the project right click new activity empty activity give the name login activity and click on finish so our activity is created we can go to activity login.xml click on split over here and we will design the login screen so login screen will be similar as create account screen also we have developed in last video so let's go to that create account xml and i will copy entire code I'll copy and make the changes so I'll copy it and paste it over here so as you can see create account screen is visible so first thing we have to do is we have to change the context to login activity other things will be similar this logo we have to change we have added login.png so I'll replace the source with login I will change the ID of this login icon and here also hello text will be same instead of let's get started we will write welcome back email also we need password also we need we don't need confirm password in login so we will remove it so instead of this button that is create account we will write log in and id will be login button progress bar also we need it so instead of already have an account we will write don't have an account and this text will be create account which will take us to create account page id also will change to create account text view button so that's it our login page is ready since we have created create account page we are easy to go so let's go to login activity and create the reference over here so same like create account also i will copy all this paste it over here so instead of create account button it will be login button instead of a login button text view it will be create account button text view and confirm password edit text we don't need so these five things we need and in onCreate method we will link to the id so i'll copy that also so confirm password we don't need create account button is login button id of login button is login button progress bar will be same login button text view will be create account text view and id will be create account text view button so you have to double check the id in xml if you do mistake it will not work it will give some error that's why you have to check your id in xml is correct or not so it is correct now we can move on now we will set the on click listener to these buttons so first button is login button dot set on click listener i will use lambda like i used before one method i will create login user so this method i will create over here void login user and also we will set on click listener to this text view button so when user want to create account he will go to create account so set on click listener lambda now here i will write the code for navigating so i will do start activity new intent login activity dot this from login activity to create account activity dot class so that's it with this button we will go to create account page now we have to write logic for login user before that i will copy one more method from this create account activity that will be this change in progress and also we need validate data i will copy both of the method I'll copy this paste it below this method and here instead of create account button it will be login button login button and in validate data we need two things only email and password this pass confirm password we don't need to validate so we can remove it that's it now we have to write the logic over here so this also we can refer to create account activity so email and password confirm password we are taking we are validating the data and creating a method for create account copy this paste it over here remove confirm password remove confirm password and if it is validated we will login in firebase so create one more method login account in firebase which will take email which will take password 
So instead of this method, I will call this method. So once email and password is validated, now we will try to login in Firebase. So to login in Firebase, we need Firebase Earth. So create an object for Firebase Earth, Firebase Earth dot get instance. And with this Firebase Earth, we can have one method that is sign in with email and password. You can see sign in with email and password, which takes email and password. We already have password. So this will log in our page but we should know when it is completed or not it is successful or failure so we can add add on complete listener as we did before new on complete listener enter here you can put semicolon so on complete method will be called after completed so before signing in we will change in progress so change in progress will be true so it will show the progress bar and after complete we will set change in progress to false so progress is completed. Now here what we will do is we will check task is successful or not. If task is successful means login is success. That means password and email is correct. Else login failed. So when email and password will be correct, this will come to is successful. But what we want is if email is not verified by the user, we will not make them able to login. So we will check if task is successful also. If Firebase auth dot get current user whoever logs in is email verified or not. If login is successful and email is verified means we can make user login. So go to main activity we will do here and if email is not verified we will show some message. So for message showing we were using toast here we have to copy paste everything. So instead of that I will create a utility class over here. It is good practice to create a utility class so I will create one utility here we will write a static method for showing the toast. Void so toast method. It will take context and the message what you want to show. That's it. So here we will write toast dot make text context message length dot sort dot show. So this method will help us to show the toast. So I'll go to create account activity also. Instead of this I will do utility dot show toast context and this message I will copy from here paste it I can remove this now so in failure also I will do same utility dot show toast context and the message I can remove this now so this show toast method we can use everywhere in the app so let's go to login activity and show toast over here utility dot show toast context will pass login activity dot this and message will be email not verified please verify your email that's it so if email is not verified we'll show the message so when login will be failed if password and email is incorrect or any other things we will show the message that will be our the message written by task exception so task dot get exception dot get localized message so if login is failed we will show the message and when login is successful we'll go to main activity that means start activity new intent login activity dot this comma main activity dot class so that's it we designed the login page and we wrote the logic for login also now in splash activity we will check that if user is logged in already we will go to main activity if user is not logged in we'll go to login activity so we'll check in this run method after one second so here we will get the user if user is logged in or not so we'll create the object of firebase user I will give the name current user equals to firebase auth dot get instance dot get current user. So it will return the current user that can be logged in user or the null value if it is not logged in. So we'll check if current user equals to equals to null that means user is not logged in. We will send the user to login activity. So from here it will go to login activity if user is not logged in else if user is logged in we will take him to main activity. So after that we will close the splash activity. So that's it. Now we can run the app and test everything. Let's run the app. So as you can see after splash screen we are in the login screen since user is not logged in already. So we'll check create account button. If I click on it, it will take me to create account page. If I click back, it will take me to login page. Now we'll check the validation first. Email I will put anything. Login. Email is invalid. So I'll put the some correct email. Password length is invalid. I will put correct length password. 
Since this email is not registered in our app, we are trying to log in with an unregistered user account. Let's see. I will click on login. It will show the message there is no user record. So that means our validation is also working correctly. So if I put correct email address and the wrong password, if I enter wrong password, it is a password is invalid or the user does not have the password. Now I will put correct password that is test123. Now if I click login, it should go to main activity. So as you can see, I am in main activity that is hello world. That means our login application is working correctly. If I click on back, it is taking me to login page, but this should not happen. We can check in login activity. If we go to main activity, we have to finish this login activity. Now, since I am already logged in, if I restart the application, it is taking me to main activity since we don't have to log in again and again. So this is working correctly fine. So every time you will go to the app, now it will directly taking me to main activity since we are already logged in. We will add logout button later, then we will check the logout feature also, but login screen is working fine. So in next video, we will design the add notes screen and we will successfully add the notes to the Firebase. So if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. If you have any doubts and queries, please comment below. I will reply for you. Don't forget to click the subscribe button before going. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.